my sister DJ Dixon, my daughter Corinne, and we saved my life. So uh, to them, to God, to a lot of great medical people, uh, I'm able to leave you this uh, video. I cannot tell you how great it feels to have your family to be in such a way. And, and y'all know they kept it airtight. They didn't let nothing out. They protected me. And that's what I hope that everyone could have in moments like these. Uh, now, you know, by being quiet, sometimes things, you know, get out of hand. People say what I got. Some people said I was, I was blind. But as you can see, uh, as you can see, the eyes are working. The eyes are working just fine. Welcome to this edition of Vibes. We talk about actor, singer, comedian Jamie Foxx shares a new video giving us an update on his condition after that health scare earlier this year. Well, first thing first, join in the conversation using the hashtag Viral Hill Connect. And don't forget, don't forget to subscribe. Subscribe is caring. Tell a friend, call a friend, hit that subscribe button so you won't miss things. We talk about singer, actor, comedian Jamie Foxx posted a video on Instagram giving us an update on his condition. Let's look before, beforehand, before we do that, let's go back the backstory on how Jamie Foxx got to where he was then with that recent health scare. Let's take a look. Corinne's Instagram, his daughter Corinne called a quote, medical complication. Corinne's Instagram post didn't go into further detail, but TMZ reports Jamie was taken to the hospital and that family members rushed to be by his side. Today, he's reportedly doing a lot better, even joking with family members as doctors try to figure out what happened. He could be in the hospital for at least a few more days. Jamie has been filming his new comedy back in action with Cameron Diaz. He personally convinced her to return to acting after an eight-year hiatus from Hollywood. Everyone's talking to you about bringing Cameron Diaz back. And it was amazing because, first of all, I've known Cameron for some years. It was just like, we miss her so much. And it was basically a plea of like, Yo, give us, give us, give us something else. But there had been drama with the movie. Jamie reportedly had a meltdown on the set because he was unhappy with the production. Filming was temporarily shut down, and four members of the crew were fired. The mess reportedly made Cameron want to re-retire. Jamie appeared to be in great shape in this video. Just a few weeks ago, heaving a football through a basketball net. <laughs> And just a few days ago, he posted this video on a yacht. Corinne revealed few details about her dad's condition, but did say this, quote, Luckily, due to quick action and great care, he is already on his way to recovery. Jamie and his oldest daughter share a special bond. Welcome to what? They starred together on their music guessing game show and she executive produced his series, Dad, Stop Embarrassing Me, loosely based on their real life relationship. Everybody to this roof goes, goes to church. church. He has so much fun and to see my daughter producing the show, putting things together, you know, that was another layer. Today, Corinne is sending this message from the Fox family about her dad. Quote, we know how beloved he is and appreciate your all right you saw right there jamie fox in a recent health scare we was going to show you the video but we was going to wait but jamie fox um a lot of people were worried jamie fox wouldn't make it give god's grace and god's glory jamie fox has made it an incredible recovery jamie fox on the road to recovery and we hope the best for him all right let's hear what jamie fox had to say for the first time ever since his health scare right now here on vow First of all, I want to say thank you to everybody that's prayed, man, and sent me messages. I cannot even begin to tell you um, how, how far it took me and how, how it brought me back. Um, uh, I went through something that I, I thought I would never, ever go through. Uh, and I know a lot of people were waiting, you know, or wanting to hear updates, but to be honest with you, I just didn't want you to see me like that, man. You know, I want you to see me laughing, having a good time, partying, cracking a joke, doing a movie, television show. I didn't want you to see me with uh, with tubes uh, running out of me and and trying to figure out uh, if if I was gonna 
make it through. And to be honest with you, my uh, my sister Deidre Dixon, my daughter Corinne Marie saved my life. So uh, to them, to God, to a lot of great medical people, uh, I'm able to leave you this uh, video. I cannot tell you how great it feels to have your family kick in in such a way. And, and y'all know they kept it airtight. They didn't let nothing out. They protected me. And that's what I hope that everyone could have in moments like these. Uh, now, you know, by being quiet, sometimes things, you know, get out of hand. People saying what I got. Some people said I was, I was blind, but as you can see, uh, as you can see, the eyes are working. The eyes are working just fine. Uh, I said I was paralyzed. I'm not paralyzed. Uh, but I did go through, I went to hell and back. And my road to recovery uh, had some potholes as well, but um, I'm, uh, I'm, 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 I'm coming back and uh, I'm able to work. So I wanna thank uh, uh, the people that let me work. Um, and I just wanna like say uh, I, that, I, that I, I love everybody and I love all of the love that I got. And man, you know, I know they talk about people crying on videos, you know, you could do take two, but I'm not gonna do a take two, this is, it is what it is. And if you see me out uh, from now on and every once in a while, I just burst into tears is because um, it's been tough, man. I was sick, man, but now I got my legs out, uh, under me, so you're gonna see me out. Uh, but like I said, I just want you to remember me for uh, the jokes that I crack, uh, the, the movies that I make, some of them good, some of them ain't. I think I got a good one out. Uh, and the songs that I sing, man. And then, you know, some people were talking about I'm clone. Well, check this out. Just kidding you. Uh, not clone, man, but I, I'm here on earth because of some great people. I'm here on earth because of God, man. So I love all y'all. Uh, I just wanted to jump on here and let you know that uh, I'm on my way back in love. What you saw right there, Jamie Foxx posting his health scare. Um, he's doing a good scratch. He said he went to hell and back. Man, you can tell he went to hell and back, but he's getting the help he needs. He's getting recovery. And kudos to Jamie. Keep up. We want you better. We want you back doing what you're doing on the road. So Shazam and everything else. So Jamie Foxx trying to be on the road to recovery. He needs to get much as rest he can get. You know what I'm saying? Much rest. So looking forward to seeing Jamie Foxx in the future. It was a good sight for him to come back and reappear and stuff. All right, let's hear what you people had to say about Jamie Foxx on his road to recovery right now. You haven't heard by now, there's an apparent Jamie Foxx update. And this motherfucker was on a boat. Apparently the real Jamie Foxx was on a boat wearing um, a little summer outfit and dark sunglasses and waved to everybody and gave a peace sign. There's also a random story about him saving some lady's lost purse and she said, yep, yeah, for sure that was Jamie Foxx. He looked great, he's well and he's healthy. So they got a random ass woman in Chicago to confirm that Jamie Foxx is well and healthy and handed her her purse. Hmm, that's really interesting. One of the most eerie facts about all of this is that he was filming a film called They Cloned Tyrone. They cloned Tyrone. No one cares? Okay. This apparently is the only photo and footage from TMZ that we can get of Jamie Foxx. This is Jamie Foxx on a boat. So according to mainstream media, he's fine. You know, my people, life is so precious. And I'm thinking about Jamie Foxx when I'm talking about that. Brother Jamie Foxx suffered an aneurysm or a stroke or something. Something, some medical complication. And all the people talking about what it is or, or what it isn't. The most important thing is that Jamie Foxx is still on this planet. That is a blessing because that is something that we all don't have guaranteed at all times. For sure, we are going to perish. And with that said, what kind of legacy do you choose to live? That is the foundation upon how you should live your life. You should live your life thinking about the future. Luckily, brother Jamie Foxx was. His whole life, his whole career, he was making movies, he was doing things for the culture. 
So with that said, I just pray for Brother Jimmy Fox, and I hope you do too. God bless you, Jamie. Jamie Foxx looking incredible. A lot of you people are um, showing support, love and support for Jamie Foxx. Jamie Foxx is coming back stronger, better, and bigger than ever. We hope that and Jamie Foxx is coming back. He looks kind of um, getting back to his normal self. So Jamie Foxx trying to, you know, maneuver around. But um, like I say, let him get some rest, rest well, come back and get that role of recovery going. Thank you all for watching this edition of Vow. We talk about Jamie Foxx share a video his new video since being on um, with the recent health scare he's back and he's on his roller recovery i've been your host kendrick dick saying so long thank you for watching Vow.